Chris, thank you very much. Time right now is 722. You know, divorce is a big issue in this country, obviously. We've always heard that statistic, divorce. Well, how do people cope with the separation from a loved one? We're joined by a woman right now who tries to put a little fun into the process. You don't really think of divorce and fun. Rosalind Sadaka joins us right now. And uh, Rosalind, first of all, you're having a divorce party? Yes. Explain this, and this is happening <laughs> in, our, in South Florida. Absolutely. I'm the author of a book called How Do I Tell the Kids About the Divorce, based mm -hmm. on my own experience when I was facing a divorce. And I met a woman recently who also is the author of another book on divorce. Her name's Christina Rowe. Her book is Seven Secrets to a Successful Divorce. We were talking about our situations, and she had a very cantankerous divorce and had mentioned that she really was disappointed she never got a chance to kind of have a divorce party. Mm -hmm. There's a growing trend around the country in different places where they're holding divorce parties where people can kind of let go, celebrate with their friends. So how do you have this divorce party? Obviously you're going to have it at this restaurant, Christopher's, but is it a situation where you're just, you know, drinking with friends and just, you know, like dancing or is it kind of a chance maybe just to sit and talk and sort of discuss maybe the new chapter in your life? It, well, it's much more than that and Christopher's is a, is a huge nightclub. So okay. we're we're going to invite people who are considering divorce, who are divorcing, facing divorce, having been divorced already, to invite their friends and celebrate in a big way. We're going to be dancing to breakup songs. We're going to have a lot of contests, best ex in South Florida, worst ex in South Florida. We're going to have a pinata to bash instead of your ex. <laughs> Throw your wedding ring in the toilet. A lot of fun and games, but behind it is a serious message. Okay. That night we're not going to be serious, but the messages behind our books are serious. We're trying to help people have a more positive outcome for their divorces. But everyone needs to kick up their heels and have fun. And this is a night where you could invite your friends, invite your sense of humor, and just let go. And our theme is, is laugh, let go, and start over again. All right, certainly a different way to look at divorce. Rosalind Sadaka is joining us. And uh, Rosalind, the book again is How Do I Tell the Kids About the Divorce? And again, the uh, divorce party. This particular one is going on at Christopher's Nightclub in Fort Lauderdale. And uh, Rosalind, once again, thank you so much for being here. We appreciate it. Thank you. All right, Rosalind Staka joining us on this Sunday morning. Now, just a reminder again, you can see right there the information. It's at Christopher's Nightclub, and it's going to take place March 7th. Christopher's, as uh, Rosalind mentioned, is on East Oakland Park Boulevard in Fort Lauderdale. This whole thing starts at 9 o'clock. It costs $10 to get in. Certainly a different way. I've never heard of these divorce parties until recently, but you know, there is an opportunity to really start a new chapter in your life, and this is what it's all about. All right, once again, thanks to Rosalind, and now, Ben, back to you. All right.